Have you ever felt backed into a corner <clears throat> as if you didn't have any choices? You had no options left. You were just stuck. Yeah, <clears throat> me too, footwork. But then I would dribble down the court, and then I would get sworn by defenders, and I'd lose my dribble. And I didn't realize at the time that I was learning a life lesson, and the life lesson was that I could pivot, right? I could right, bring the ball up, open up some options, move left. I always had a pivot foot. Even if I couldn't dribble, I always had that one foot that I could turn on and come up with some options, and, and always an open man would, would present themselves eventually, right? And I could pass in the ball. I didn't realize how valuable that would be for my recovery. I want to tell you about two really smart people. Albert Einstein said that if he had an hour to solve a problem, he'd spend 55 minutes understanding the problem and five minutes working on a solution. I think it's true. We really need to understand what is our corner so that we can find a way out of our corner. And then Abraham Lincoln, he said if given six hours to chop down a tree, he'd spend the first, hour, first four hours sharpening his axe. Right, he wouldn't touch the tree for the first four hours until his instrument was ready and he was prepared to take action. So I think understanding the problem and doing the preparation work in order to get into the solution is super, super important. So I don't want you to forget that you have options, that you can pivot, that you might need to look around. You might need to understand the problem in a bigger way. You might need to take a step back, take a bird's eye view of it. But you can always pivot. You can always change directions. You can always even go back to where you began. Maybe you can take a different turn. So you always have options. And I believe that you can get out of any corner clean. I believe in you.